When I was uh, in prison in San, San, San Roque, ah, sorry, San, Santa Rosa, you see, uh, this is Santa Rosa, the granal that was this year to that in a Muslim, that was a TV. Bago nung galit mo nasa po sa ano, sa incarceration, sabi niya, I'm surprised when the government is preparing plunder case against Governor Lumi Suari. In the base of our knowledge, he said, his governance was so far the cleanest and the best and the most successful. After a couple of months, dumating yung ano, without any petition from us, dumating sa amin ang kanyang uh, certification. Sinabi niya, voluntary. We vouch to the fact that government has no right whatsoever to, uh, uh, you know, to file any complaint or plunder against your administration because uh, to the base of our knowledge, It was the best governance, the most honest, and the most successful. Here in Sinabi, you know, the Sierto, try to find out in the Kodi Makalimutan if he's still alive. In fact, when I was in Manila a few days ago, I I told my my nephews, "Kapo, maghanap ka ng kopya mo, kasi na wala." No, siguro may nag may nag Muslim, may nag Sierto kami, kami kano? Oh. I didn't, I didn't get what... We did, this is not a show, dog. Okay, okay, okay. 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 With this kind of words that we see with the MNN right now, this is the issue that this shows that we are opposing the framework of people. Well, of course, uh, we cannot accept this because this is a recipe to another word in the If you go through the uh, text, the text and read between the line of the text and also go to the uh, October 7 the speech at Malacanang Palace of uh, President uh, Aquino uh, juxtapose these two those documents and uh, go through them again and again you will come to realize that first of all this is an attempt to downgrade and in fact ultimately abrogate our series of peace treaty agreements in the past You see, you know, you should remember, I don't know, you're still too young to maybe to understand or to know. As early as December 1976, 76, Oreya had signed a peace treaty agreement, formal peace treaty agreement with uh, the uh, government of the late President Marcos. And the man who presided over the peace process, the peace talks, Later on, became president of the United Nations General Assembly. His Excellency uh, Dr. Abdul Salam Ali Triki. He was candidate of the 53 uh, African countries uh, to become the uh, president of the United Nations General Assembly. You see, si ayon na nagpreside and si ang nagsign on behalf of the OIC. You see, yung peace agreement. Eh, pagkatapos yan, uh, as you know, hindi ba, hindi nila na Then later on, in 1987, uh, by virtue of the cordiality I had, uh, you know, made with uh, the late Coronel Aquino, kasi tinulungan ko siya. Kung hindi ko tinulungan, uh, si Cory, hindi siya magiging presidente yun. Oh, she was on the verge of withdrawing her candidacy. Sabi niyo si, tanong mo niyo si Buchaquino. I don't know, hanggang ngayon, they're not opening their mouth. Because they went to see me in Madrid, and they pleaded before me, Brother, no, please help us. Kasi umayo ako in the beginning. Help us set democracy. I said, how? You support the candidacy of Cory. Bakit ka po? I, she will be losing as he will lose in, in the election by landslide victory. Ipakita niya, bigyanin niya ito sa mga tao na yan. 
Kasi wala, parang wala silang ano, utang na loob. I'm not asking for that, but for civilized people, utang na loob is a very good quality talaga, which you cannot just uh, put aside. I have a mother. Tanungin ninyo, kung makaya niyo, kung kaya ninyo ang grave ni Minoy, ni, 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 at saka man, asawa niyo. Yun ang promise nila. And when they campaign sila dito, kasama si na uh, Ambassador uh, Bukay Lalonto and uh, Attorney uh, Siwa, Timawag din ako niya. Attorney from uh, uh, Sorry, Bukay Lalonto from Kamigin, who is running for Congress sa Kamigin, si Mubono Adasa. He called up a few days ago. Tanungin niyo sila. Sila ang nagsama kay ano, kaya ano dito sa Mindanao, paikot-ikot. Ah, sa kanilang campaign, ni Cory, ito ang sinabi niya, paulit-ulit, if and when I win through the support of Brother Noor and his brothers and sisters in Mindanao, then I will give you an autonomy much greater and much better than that of the people of Mindanao. Yan ang sinabi. Kaya nga, when uh, Pimentel and Butch Aquino and others flew to get that, have this formal talks with us after my uh, summit meeting with Corey on the 5th of September 1986. Pumunta sila kasama si Pinoy, who is still a young man. Kasama si Andrelli, ang presidente ng Senado ngayon. Kasama rin si uh, Pina Ramos. Kasama si General Magno. Kasama ang lahat. Malami sa kabinete. Pumunta sa akin. Ako, bakit kayo bumunta dito? I'm just fulfilling my pledge to you. If and when I win the election, that was September 5, 1986. First thing I do would be, I promise myself, and I promise you, I'll fly to any corner of the world uh, so I can extend my hands of gratitude and gratitude.